Good morning, Keller Williams, and welcome back to the KW Command 66 Day Challenge 9.0. And today is day 59. So today I'm going to highlight uh, once again our KW Command app, but the feature I'm going to show you today is actually also available inside of KW Command on the desktop, and that is our Quick or KW IQ option. We know that AI is prolifer proliferating <laughs> our lives. Uh, it's pretty much in everything we do, and KW Command is no different. KWIQ is sort of your uh, chat GPT, Ask Gary tool, if you will, uh, that you can use to help your business. So Quick is found underneath our hamburger menu in the bottom right-hand corner. We're going to click on those three little lines. We're going to get that pop-up menu, and we're going to go to KWIQ. And essentially, this works like most of your Claude, ChatGPT, Gemini style uh, AI tools. You're going to give it a prompt, and then it's going to give you questions. Now, KWIQ or Quick is a closed language learning model, meaning that it has been fed a ton of stuff, but that stuff is all around Keller Williams. So think about uh, Millionaire Real Estate Agent, Shift, The One Thing. Um, you know, all of our training materials, Ignite, etc. So it's not going to be, t probably not going to tell you what the capital of Texas is. Um, and yet it's going to be able to tell you things like you see on the screen. So if you scroll down, you're going to get about five or six different prompts available to you. Um, and you can click on these and it'll actually just give quick that prompt and then provide you with the response. So I just clicked on the very bottom one there. What should I post on social media to engage more buyers? And here you go, it's feeding me now, we're up to nine, maybe 10, can we go for 12? Uh, there we go, so 10 different types of things that I might consider posting on social media. And I'm just scrolling back up to the top so we can see all of this. All right, just some ideas to get the juices flowing, if you will, how to engage more buyers on social media. Let's ask the reverse question, just for kicks and giggles. So I'm gonna to say to engage more sellers on social media, what should I be posting? And click on send. So here we go, it's gonna scroll down to the bottom and we're gonna see what sort of different items it gives us. So there you go, some different items with regards to posts that you might consider on selling or sellers listing content. And it actually gave us 12 on this one. So uh, you might be in a training class and someone says, why 4C2Ts? And you're still pretty new to KW and you're like, what does that mean? Hopefully you know how to spell it. What? is and as w i four y four c two t e s and let's just see what it comes up with there you can also put in what's keller williams value statement what's keller williams mission statement you can ask it questions around mrea um, so here you go it breaks down y four c two t's right there inside of kwiq um, What's the number one thing agents, let's just see, I'm just giving it random problems now. What's the number one thing agents overspend on when it comes to marketing? Let's just see, I mean, that's a little bit out there question, right? So let's just see what it comes back to based upon everything that it's been fed. Uh, haven't learned that yet, so try Search and Connect. So you can see, it's somewhat limited. Um, you know, Obviously, we have additional tools that we can use with things like Chappie Chi, et cetera. But if you're really looking for uh, to learn more in the Keller Williams ecosphere, KWIQ, a really powerful and important tool. Again, on your desktop command version, I believe they're actually working on potentially moving the location. Uh, right now, it should be in the bottom right-hand corner, if I recall. Um, and they may be moving it to the top toolbar. So we'll have to see uh, where it ends up landing. But just look for those three little star sparkle looking things on your screen that you can see on the left. Uh, that's going to be your KWIQ icon. And then you can click on that and start utilizing it. That's it for today, guys. Just a brief introduction and test run through of KWIQ utilizing the KW Command app. As always, I hope you're having a fantastic day. I look forward to speaking with you again real soon.